Hey guys! My name is Amanda, I'm a postgraduate student at the University of Stirling and today together we will do a quick room tour of the student accommodations of the university that are on campus. So if you think that's a good idea, please keep watching. This is the first thing that you see when you enter the room. On the right you can see uh, the closet with some drawers and more storage here and these four very big shelves. As you can see, I keep my everyday shoes here with my umbrella, um, some snacks that I may have during the day, my hair products and some bags there. So let's move forward. Um, here is the bed. Uh, this is, I think, the best part of the room. It's very big for one person and that's why I love it. Uh, you don't have to worry about the bed sheets or the duvet because the accommodation provides you with all these so you don't have to worry about that. So next to the bed you can see that there is a small heater and a little desk. So I have to say that you will never feel cold in these rooms. The heaters are on almost all year, almost all day. Of course you can turn it off, uh, it's up to you. But uh, yeah, it's amazing, it's very warm here, even in the winter. As you can see, I use a diffuser because we are not allowed to use candles inside our rooms, but that's okay. Uh, here is a very big mirror and I love it and I usually keep my jewelry here. So above the bed, it's a very big board and you can decorate it with anything that you want. I decided to put some postcards and some fairy lights, but I have to mention again that we are only allowed to use fairy lights that work with batteries. Also, above the bed there is this small, very cute light that you may use, um, maybe if you want to read a book during the night. So let's move forward. Here is the window of the room. As you can see, I decided to decorate that space with two small plants and a pink pillow. I love pink, you can tell. So this is the view from my room. As you can see, all the accommodations are very close to each other. And for me, that's very cool because it makes me feel more safe, if that makes sense. So as we're moving forward, you can see that the room has a massive desk here and it's very convenient, um, to, especially for studying uh, and especially if you like to study inside your room. Uh, also, the accommodation provides you with a chair and this cute little bean. Um, I decided to put a pillow for uh, my back issues, just for the record. Also, uh, there is some space here as well. Um, you can see how I decided to decorate this space with some small decorations and of course the cute little University of Sterling squirrel. So this is the room from the window side. As you can see, there is a hanger behind that door uh, where you can put your bathrobe or your bag or whatever. I have to mention that all the doors here work with the card and not a key and I think that's very convenient and very useful. Um, as we're moving forward you can see uh, this door which leads to the bathroom. As you enter the room you can see the toilet and on the right is uh, the shower which is very, very nice, very big for one person, and uh, I love it. Uh, here is the mirror, hi again, <laughs> um, with the sink. And there is a little shelf here to put like some toiletries, um, your creams, your deodorants, your shampoos, I don't know. So yeah, that is the washroom. Um, it's very sweet and it's more than enough for one person, and yeah. It's very useful so far. I think it's time to discuss some things about the flats. So I live in a flat with six other people. Um, it's a lovely experience, I have to admit it. We are six very different people from different places in the world and it's something that I really love and like because when I came here uh, I really didn't think how 
amazing this experience would really be because uh, it's just so interesting to meet people from all over the world and get to know other cultures and other cuisines as well it's lovely and uh, i'm very grateful that i met these people in my life it's uh, an amazing experience now it's time to see the rest of the flat so if you think that's a good idea keep watching here is the whole room that's my room and also outside the rooms there are these cute little boards that we decided to decorate with some little people and um, each one of us designed uh, something that represents them uh, in these little people and uh, I really think that's lovely. So as we are moving forward we can see other rooms as well. And now we're going towards the kitchen. Also, I have to mention that the accommodation provides us a vacuum, so you don't need to bring anything. As you can see now, we are in the kitchen. Uh, the kitchen is very big and it's uh, very nice for six people that we are in this flat. As you can see, there is enough space for everyone to store their things as well as to cook. Uh, we have one fridge and two freezers, two ovens and a lot of hobs to cook. There are two sinks as well so there is never an issue for everyone to like wash their dishes or cook at the same so time. The accommodation provides us with a toaster and a kettle as well as a microwave which is very convenient and very easy to use. The kitchen also has um, a small living room so we have two couches uh, and a TV and a very big uh, dining table. Um, as you can see, the kitchen is decorated uh, because yesterday was uh, one of our flatmates' birthday. So we decorated the kitchen with some balloons and uh, yeah, I think it's uh, lovely. Now I would like to talk to you a bit about the kitchen because uh, for me it's my favorite uh, spot in the flat, if that makes sense. Uh, so as I mentioned before, we are six different people from six different countries studying different subjects. So for us it's very difficult to meet during the day and have lunch together or just chill in the kitchen. That's why we always share dinner together every day. And after dinner, after cooking together, we always put some music and dance or watch a movie or we play board games. We have a lot of board games. And uh, yeah, I think that's my favorite part of the day because I really like when we are all together and we laugh and we spend time together. It's really lovely. Apart from the board games, with my flatmates, we bought some other games like like badminton or mini golf and uh, we really love playing in our uh, later time and it's a very fun activity to do all together. Yes, now that we are done with the flat tour I would like to say some few things. Um, I really like to explain why I decided to stay on campus and why I haven't regret that idea at all. So when I started applying for accommodations uh, here in Sterling, I felt more safe to stay on campus because I wanted to be close to the university and all the lectures and the classes that I have. Uh, and also because of the 24-7 security that they provide. But for my surprise, I discovered how many things the university offers. So inside the campus, we have a pharmacy, we have a supermarket, we have a medical center, we have so many cafes and restaurants with a lot of vegan and vegetarian options. We have the massive uh, sports center, which is very modern and new, and you must try this. And uh, yeah, I really like living with so many different people uh, every day i learn so many new things and i'm very grateful for that um so yeah that was it i hope you liked it and thanks for watching bye, -bye.